I'm pretty sure I'm the only one who at age eight had his mother say to him, if you massage my feet for 45 minutes, I'll let you stay up late and watch Psycho. I had a coworker who came up to me the other day at work and asked me if suicide was covered in life insurance. I said, no, I already looked into it. I get really confused in life because I have one group of people telling me that I'm way too melodramatic, and I have another group of people telling me that I just need to be myself, and I can't understand why they don't realize I am being myself! Once a week, my wife and our eight-year-old son, we have what we call movie night, which is a really wonderful bonding experience with my family. We get together and we watch a movie on the big screen television. My son makes little admit one tickets and he pretends to be the usher and it, it's fantastic. Two weeks ago we watched Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs. Last week we watched The Sound of Music. I'm really excited. Uh, next week we're going to have a double feature, Goodfellas and Django Unchained. I had a ladies room installed in my house so that my wife has a place to cry. Is there anybody here in the forest that's ever been called a peckerwood? Some people say they'd like to be a fly on the wall so they could hear people's conversations. I'd rather be a wasp. That way people would run away screaming. My boss came up to me at work the other day and he said, You know, you remind me a lot of that guy from the show Dexter. And I said, I've never watched Dexter. Who is he? Oh, he's a serial killer. Hey, can we give it up for the squirrels? I see ya. Don't throw any acorns at me. My wife and I recently celebrated our one-year wedding anniversary, and she told me that she would, when having sex, would pretend to be anyone that I wanted her to be, and that included a celebrity. I immediately thought, Chaz Bono. I had a woman come up to me the other day and say to me, you know, if you weren't married, and you didn't have a child, I would murder you. There's a lot of albums that people like to listen to when they're making love to their partner. And some of the albums that come to mind are Marvin Gaye, Greatest Hits, Barry White, Greatest Hits, Enigma, Sade. But there's one album in particular that I like to listen to that I don't think has gotten enough attention. And that is an album called Iowa by the group Slipknot and it goes something like this. <laughs> no, but seriously, how about these mosquitoes, huh? <laughs> I'd like to open a computer repair shop and have all of my customers be auto mechanics who don't know a thing about computers. I really like the song, Wump There It Is by Tag Team. These three words, when you're getting busy, Wump There It Is. But I don't think many people have noticed that Wump There It Is is actually four words. Is it creepy to say to a woman that you'd like to be her thong? Love is special. Love is a scare. Love is priceless and very rare. Though many times you think you die, love sews you up and makes a tie. Sometimes love makes you part. It hurts your feelings and breaks your heart. Sometimes love means you care, and sometimes love lets you share. Life is secluded, sometimes free. Life is the door, and I would love to bake a tuna casserole with Stevie Nicks. Thank you, that's my time. My name's Matthew Stromer.